breakfast is where I really shine. When I moved from Ireland to San Francisco, I started up a catering business that specialized in over-the-top breakfasts. Just like today's recipe of strawberry cheesecake pancakes. Graham cracker pancakes, cheesecake frosting, and strawberry sauce. You are gonna love them. Before we get started on the pancakes, I really suggest you check out my other video for the perfect foolproof buttermilk pancakes. It's really good how-to tips on how to make foolproof pancakes every time. To make your pancake batter, weigh out all your dry ingredients in a large bowl. Your flours, your raising agents, salt, and cinnamon. And then mix them all together. For the wet ingredients you need, your buttermilk, egg, vanilla extract, and your runny honey. And then whisk until well combined. To make your pancake batter, we're gonna add our wet into our dry and then lastly add the butter and only mix it enough to spell the word pancake. Perfect. Some wet flour, some dry. We're gonna get the last bit by adding in our butter, butter at room temperature, and we're just gonna mix this in for three mixes. The number one killer of pancake batter is over mixing. So if you stick to my rule of spelling out pancake, you'll always have a perfect batter every time. While our pancake batter is resting in the fridge, we're gonna get started on our cheesecake frosting and our strawberry sauce. In a large bowl, add in your cream cheese, sugar, and one tablespoon of lemon juice. A little tip about juicing a lemon, put it on the counter and just push it against the tabletop. And it breaks down the insides and it makes them much easier to juice. It actually smells like an orange, that's how sweet they are. Beat together until smooth and no lumps. And then add in your cream and continue to beat until you have a stiff mix. Make sure you taste it. Oh, oh, it's yummy. Oh, it tastes like cheesecake. It tastes like the cheesecake that my mum would make. That's what it tastes like. To make your strawberry sauce, you're gonna hull and slice one pound of beautiful, fresh spring strawberries. Look at all that beautiful color. Sauce is gonna be fantastic. Add in a quarter cup of granulated sugar, quarter cup of water, and the juice of half a lemon. I'm gonna use the lemon that I used earlier on, so I get to use all of it. On a medium heat, cook your strawberries for around 20 minutes until all the strawberries break down and make a beautiful syrupy sauce. Now that our pancake batter is rested, let's get cooking. In a non-stick pan, get a nice medium heat. Grease your pan with butter. Scoop a generous spoonful of your batter for each pancake. If your batter is a little bit thick, then spread it out with a spoon, but not too much. You can see the color changing around the rim, and you can see little pancake pillars starting to form that are gonna hold up your pancake. Let's build a stack of pancakes with all the lovely flavors that we made. I'm gonna do four layers because I want mine to be really big and bold. And then I'm gonna finish it with a beautiful, vibrant red strawberry sauce, just in time for spring. I don't see why cheesecake can't be a breakfast food. I really hope you enjoyed this week's recipe. I love these pancakes and I know you will too. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and we'll see you back here again next Thursday for more Bigger Bolder Baking.